GenSpark AI Sheets tutorial for beginners. Hello everyone and welcome back. In today's video, I'll be showing you guys step by step on how you can get started with AI Sheets using GenSpark. Now, what exactly is GenSpark? GenSpark is an AI tool that has a super agent, AI slides, sheets, charts, and multiple combinations of AI agents that can help you in finding the best content, generating the best videos and the best images. So let's get started with GenSpark. To get started, simply head on over to GenSpark AI and then click on sign up. It's free. You can sign up using your Google account or your email address. I am going to be creating my account using Google. So I'm just going to click on Google over here to proceed with my account creation. And I'm just going to select my email address from here and then continue on. Now, once I do this, I will proceed on to my GenSpark account. And this is how simple and easy it is to create your account on GenSpark. Now, once you have created your account on GenSpark, first off, we're going to take a look at some of the different agents that you can use. So if you click on all agents over here, you can explore the specialities of each agent. So they have their super agent, which can help you make calls, make travel plans and so much more. Then we have AI slides downloaded for me so you can download anything. You have AI sheets. So AI sheets specifically is really amazing to analyze information, categorize it and make a really nice log of information from a large messy document. You can find 10 GenSpark YouTube videos and analyze metrics and comments, find 20 key concepts from AP assignments and assess the understanding, so on and so forth. They also have a call for me agent, a deep research and fact checker. We're going to go into AI sheets and get started. Now on the bottom, you can get started with a brand new chat and you can open up the AI sheets mode to see some of the basics of this particular model. Now I'm going to put in my basic prompt that I've already created, which is to make a list of all American healthcare startups that are a series A or series B stage founded after 2020 and their most recent funding round occurring in 2023 or later. Include a brief description of their business founders, industry category, funding information, investors, and employee size. So instead of American healthcare startups, I want want to focus on global uh, makeup brands, brands or startups. Now, after that, I am going to just put in my prompt and I don't even have to find the data myself. GenSpark AI agent is going to find the data for me and it's going to use its research tools, its deep research tools, its web search tool to find the relevant information and then categorize it and build amazing sheets for me. So I'm going to wait a little while to have it analyze and find the information that I'm looking for. So now it has analyzed all the relevant information. Now in the first step, what it did was procure all of the information. So if you want to see all of the information it procured, you can just click on view and it has created a comprehensive list of global makeup brands at series A or B stage founded after 2020. And from here, this information was taken using Crunchbase. Now we have the funded organization, the funding round name, as well as the investment type the money raised as well as the announcement, the country, as well as the funded organization category and the funded organization name. So you guys can see we have a bunch of different makeup brands that have been uh, listed and it was able to list over 113 names. Now after that, it enhanced the table that I requested and from here, it needs to add columns for business descriptions, funding, and investors. It set up the header slits. Then below that, the table structure was set up. Now I can click on view over here. And these are all of the resources that it has taken. So these are from LinkedIn, from multiple different articles from all over the web. So it has done its parallel research. Then after that, the table is well structured. And then after that, it was able to have a good foundation table, but it filled out some more information. Now, after that, it has taken these companies that specifically meet the three criteria that I set up. So companies that meet my criteria are these three companies, Wonderskin, Makeup by Mario, and then Insempra. Then we have Beauty Biotechnology, Makeup Brand, Makeup Brand, and then I can click on view over here to see all of the missing information. So these are the only three that fit all of my criteria. And then below that, it has further categorized my information. Now it is going to update my cells and based upon my specific requirements, it can build a specific data set and 
based upon this, it's going to further filter out the table that it has created. You can just cross this out on the right and you can ask it to fact check it. Not only that, you can also click on continue searching and it will continue on searching and providing you with more information. What I like to do is I like to click on view and export and I can export this sheet and keep it for later research. These types of sheets and uh, these types of knowledge bases are so expensive to procure because data enrichment is one of the most expensive things that you have to do as a new business owner. So this is going to save you a lot of time and a lot of money. All I have to do is export to CSV on the top right and then I can export this sheet into a CSV file and download this within my device. Now moving on, I can not only just create these amazing sheets, but I can also click on visualize. Once I do that, this will put in a prompt to use a data analysis tool to analyze the table and then use that to create a HTML tool to generate a report. And I'm just going to do that. And now what it's going to do is that it is going to proceed with building a data analysis. You have some free research tools as well. And based upon a free account, you might not be able to process this information further. So you would have to upgrade your account on GenSpark. But GenSpark does let you do a lot of trying and a lot of testing before you have to upgrade your account. Just being able to procure all of this really valuable information is going to serve you really well. So if I want to take a look at some of the highest valuations or the lowest valuations, this is super ordinary with 58 million, we have 50 million, so on and so forth. We have a bunch of these funded organizations and I can go into the investors, employee size, websites, and the funded organization names and I can find the relevant information that I want. If I want to find the emails of their marketing employees, their executives, I can also further do that and it will be able to extract data that is available on the internet. Now, this is not the only thing you can do with GenSpark. GenSpark is an amazing sheet tool and it is available to build a visual organization of, of your sheets as well. But you can also go with AI Chat and you have several different models. So what you can do, instead of having to use GPT, Claude, Gemini, or DeepSeek, you can click on Mixture of Agents. And what that does is that that allows you to get the best of all of your AI agents. This makes sure that whatever answers you are looking for are accurate and you're able to get variations of the answer. You're able to find the most appropriate answer for your queries. Not only that, but you can also go into the AI slides feature to be able to create visual slides of whatever data you have procured. So if you created an amazing sheet, you can build that into a slide simply by uploading that data sheet and asking it to be converted into a slideshow. Now, this is amazing, but at what price does GenSpark come at? So if you are looking to purchase GenSpark, you are going to have to upgrade your plan and they have two primary plans that you can proceed with. So if you click on the bottom left, your settings icon, click on upgrade plan over here, you have two plans. You have the plus plan and the pro plan and on monthly billing, it costs $24.99 for their plus plan and $249.99 on their pro plan. The plus plan gives you 10,000 credits and the pro gives you 125,000 credits. So these are the amazing plans available on GenSpark. And if you subscribe to the annual billing, you get a discount. So it's only $20 per month if you go for annual billing on the plus plan and $200 a month on the pro plan. So I hope you guys found this video helpful. And if you guys did find this video helpful, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. And if you have any questions or queries, leave those in the comments down below. I would love to know what you guys have to say.